So, I know this has been killed off. <laughs> but we're talking about e-boys and e-girls. <laughs> you may be asking yourself, what is an e-boy? What is an e-girl? Why do you look like you have children in your basement? I do not have children in my basement because I don't even have a basement to begin with. This is a shed, not a basement. <laughs> but on to the more important questions. An e-boy or e-girl is short for electronic boy slash girl. As you can imagine, the content is cringe, as to be expected. <laughs> they all look like they are emotionally starved and probably depressed. <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, yeah, you could probably find these guys on TikTok. Uh, I did delete it, but for the sake of research, I had to re-download it, and now I'm going to bully e-boys and e-girls because it is fun to do. So you may be asking yourself, what does an e-boy slash e-girl typically look like? Well, an e-girl usually have big boobs, thick thighs, beautiful, Asian, probably a slut, <laughs> And e-boys, edgy, dark, probably depressed, uh, a jawline you can sharpen a sword on, and, um, uh, and wears black, technically. <laughs> of course, I don't have a jawline, so I'm not an e-boy. <laughs> But uh, in terms of e-girls, let's let's bully e-boys first, because bullying women on the internet is uh, it's, it's a mix, it's a mixed bag of nuts. <laughs> so your typical e-boy on TikTok is well, cringe. <laughs> I watched a little. I was going to invest an hour into this, but I don't have an hour, so I can't invest an hour into this. Yay! So, uh, what does your typical, so your e-boy, your typical e-boy, typically black, uh, I'm wearing gray, I'm actually wearing full gray, the only black thing on my flip-flops, and my beautiful hair. Oh, speaking of e-boy hair, uh, I don't, oh, fuck, I cannot do this. Uh, your, your typical e-boy typically have that curtain hair, you know, you can probably block out the sun with the hair they have. Uh, they also have tattoos, do I look emo? Hello, Kimo. They also have tattoos on them. Uh, tattoos on their fist. These, these bad boys. These fingers. You know, the center towards the joint finger. You know, that. Yeah, they have tattoos on that. Crosses, the word dead, skulls, flowers, snakes. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, your typical e-boy. Cringe. Uh, I mean, if you really wanted to torture someone, just play a video of an e-boy. There you go. You'll get all the information you'll ever need. Or alternatively, you can just play a video of their wife or girlfriend cheating on them, give them a gun and tell them, hey, I'll drive you home with this fully loaded gun if you tell me everything I need. That also works. Now, uh, well, I mean, on top of that, oh, yeah, e-boys, vaping. Vaping is cool, right? <laughs> Remember vaping? Remember vaping? Yeah, that that's... <laughs> Oh god, that's still a thing! <laughs> oh boy, yeah. Yeah, vaping. Yeah, remember that? Remember all the cool 13-year-olds back in 2016? Or, uh, high schoolers? All the cool high schoolers back in 2016, 2017? Yeah, vapes? Yeah, remember that shit? Oh yeah, that, that shit was poggers. Uh, yeah. So, your e-boys are... Oh! Yeah, they take a big hit of that shit. Uh, they're... And, um, on top of that, they typically listen to very edgy music, you know? Uh, music... <coughs> that typically involves killing people. Boink. Haha. <laughs> Another thing about the e-boys, as I may have pointed out earlier, and if you watch Pirate Cynical, he also pointed out, they got a fucking jawline, dude. Like, holy shit, you can cut carrots on that shit. Sharpen a short, make a girl come a thousand times if you put on her clear list, just... You know? <laughs> She'll go like... <laughs> She'll come. A million times. I probably should have checked the comments to see if there was any girls, but yeah. <laughs> so, we talked about the e-boys. 
Let's talk about the e-girls. <laughs> e-girls, they're just like e-boys. Edgy, dark, probably has a boob window, maybe has like that uh, succubus tattoo on their, you know, thing. And they probably have the word cum dumpster written on their ass or maybe nerf this, who knows. <laughs> they typically do cosplays, uh, and when they're not doing cosplays, they're wearing full black tattoos, piercing, little uh, cross piercings, because that's emo, right? That's emo. <laughs> E-boys and e-girls. I mean, if you really think about it, e-boys and e-girls are just another version of emos, you know? <laughs> black, looks like they want to fucking kill themselves. Do you want to come in, Nozer? Okay. Come on, come in. Well, now that I got my dog in, I can probably stomach this a little more. Uh, he left. He does not like e -boys. You heard it from Dozer, guys. My dog. Dozer does not like e-boys and e-girls. That's poggers. Ha, 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 ha. Another thing about e-girls, they're thick. Oh, did I mention they're thick? Yeah, they have huge fucking boobs. And they have thighs. <laughs> If you cut the thighs off, you can make chicken legs. That's how thick they are. They can crush a watermelon. And they can crush my non-existent jawline head. The fucking yee looking ass haircut over here. <laughs> and on top of that, they're also beautiful. Which means they typically have more views. Because, you know, whamin, beautiful, coomer. <laughs> Pedo. Ha 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 ha. And another thing. They also vape. So that's twice the cringe. Uh, and if they sold uh, vinyl figures, they'd probably sell out, tossed into jars, you know, that kind of thing. <laughs> Their bathwater probably sell it like crazy. Remember when Belle Delphine did that? Yeah, Belle Delphine sold bathwater. Yeah, if, if e-girls did that, it'd sell like millions. <laughs> Unfortunately, e-girl is not as well-defined as e-boy. E-girl can mean anything. Uh... Just Minx is an e-girl. An emo can be an e-girl. Uh, any girl on the internet can be defined as an e-girl, unlike e-boy, which is just an emo guy on the internet. That's an e-boy, you know. But, uh, I mean, who knows? Maybe we can just restrict electronic boys and girls, you know. I don't know. Um, and, uh, yeah. So... E-boys, e-girls, typically edgy, you know. Oh, another thing about e-boys. <laughs> Bangs. They're associated with that. Bangs. Muscles. Choking. Looked like I was about to do a fucking vibe check. <laughs> I did not read any comments. I read one, but it was just mostly like, oh yeah, the music he listens to is totally depressing, but he totally listens to cheery music. <laughs> I'm pretty sure someone down there, there's like a girl who's like, ah! Choke me, daddy, and she's like super slutty and shit, whatever. <laughs> and uh, e girls again, <laughs> a succubus logo on their womb location on their body, probably dump a uh, pumpster dump truck written on their ass. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, if you put an e boy and e girl together, you're gonna have mini babies because oh, it's horny. Oh. <laughs> You know? Another thing I like to point out, uh, tattoos. They always have tattoos. <laughs> Depending on the gender, the tattoo may entirely change. Like, again, for an example, the boys and girls, or boys, they have tattoos here, while the girls have tattoos on their arms, and, you know, you know. <laughs> uh, and yeah, tattoos, emo, totally edgy, cool, and earrings, earrings on their ears. Because that's also emo, right? Right, guys? Poggers, emo, haha. <laughs> oh, my wife left me, even though I don't have one. Haha. <laughs> so, <laughs> what did we learn? <laughs> we learned that this era's, it's kind of fucked. Yeah, Gen Z's kind of fucked. <laughs> uh, my my non-existent wife left me for an e boy, uh, and then she left that e boy for a. Guy wearing a maid dress and can ears and then Yeah, she's a cheating whore. <laughs> she doesn't exist, but she's a cheating whore. Ha ha ha. Oh, and um E boys and E girls, try to be less emo, okay? Yeah, maybe be a little more quirky, tacky, you know, that that can really do wonders. And that's it for my commentary YouTube video.
So yeah.